Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. Today I will show you how to set up system snapshots and configure them in your Linux Mint distribution. Now system snapshots are very important because um, if something goes wrong with your operating system or you keep getting errors, you can always roll back to a previous and earlier timestamp when your system partition was healthy. It's very similar to the system re restore function in Windows 10. Now to get to your snapshots, go to your bottom right to update manager. If you don't know where that is, you can just search for it in the search box in the menu and click on your update manager. Go to the top where it says edit and then click on system snapshots. Put in your authentication password. And here we are in the time shift menu where you can set up and configure your system snapshots. First of all, at the top, you can create one now manually, and that will create one as we speak. But I'm going to cancel it now because that will take too long for this video. Then you can go to an earlier timestamp or snapshot, and you can restore it and then follow the prompts to um, restore your system to a earlier uh, snapshot where your system partition was healthy. You can manually delete, click on one and delete it. And then, yeah, the most important is the settings. Now, select snapshot type. You can leave it at R sync. Um, the default, I've had no problems with that in my experience. Location is important because if you have a system partition, I've got a system partition and a data partition. If you have a system partition, which is low on disk space, you can always set it to your data partition where you have got more disk space. As you can see, I've got plenty disk space, so I've set mine to that. Then schedule is also important. You can do a monthly, weekly, daily, hourly, and a boot. And then um, I've set mine to daily, and I've kept three copies. So you can always increase this, the amount of snapshot levels to keep, or you can decrease it. I don't like to be more than three and less than three, so three is my optimum preference. As you can see here, if I go back quickly to my system snapshots, I have three. So every day, um, it'll create a new one and then automatically delete the, next, the last one. And that is good because especially for disk space, if you're low on disk space, don't go too crazy with your snapshots because you could run out of disk space pretty soon. Let's just go back to the settings. Okay, there we are on schedule. Users, you can just leave this at default. I haven't had any problems. That you can leave at default. And over here you have the opportunity to change the way the date and time looks. And I've set mine to that, that preference there. So that is how you set up and use and configure the system snapshot a feature in Linux Mint. I hope you found this video useful. Once again, thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.